no grill, but you're sparkling. Hold that thought. <laughs> Oh my god! Yeah! You know, it really takes artists like 10 years of their whole career to get this much jewelry. And this isn't even all my jewelry. If you've got an old one, you don't want any more. <laughs> <laughs> And there's still loose change in there, baby. There's still loose change in there. Oh, my choker is broke. This nigga's trying to walk away. <laughs> and they're shining, man. Catch, bitch. YouTube.com slash Tim Westwood TV. Yo, Tim Westwood TV. Up a capital extra, Trippy Red family. How are you, man? I'm hanging, I'm hanging, I'm hanging. Thank you, family. Now, let's not front a little under the weather. Right. Let's not front about that. So I appreciate you six, coming. Six, six, six. six. <laughs> little stomach upset. TR six, six, six. Six, six, six. Mm. What is that? Just the, the travel, the food, the air conditioning, um, late night partying, drinking. Too much oil on the salad. I got basically milk and the tea. Like some food poisoning type shit. Oh, for real. Yeah, I was eating nasty ass room service. Undercooked hash browns and undercooked omelets and undercooked bacon. They don't know how to cook out here. First things first, then, brother. Big day, Tuesday. Let's not front. Right. Twenty. We salute you, man. How you feel? Uh, I feel sick. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> but you'll be well. But and what you've got, you've got Berlin and then home. Uh huh. So you'll be home soon. Do, is it yeah, I think we think it's Berlin next. And then home? Paris. And Paris. And Paris. And, Paris. and then. We're going to be in Berlin for like two, three days? Two days. Okay. But 20, baby, how you feel about that? Crazy. Yeah. Crazy. Gonna get lit every day? Um, What's the plan? I'm really just trying to have a normal birthday this time. And normal being just. Uh, like off. last year was um, getting out of jail, and then uh, five minutes later, X dies, and then next thing you know, I'm on a jet flying to fucking some different state to go to court. Like, it was just ass. It was an ass birthday. And my birthdays are never good, but. This time it's gonna be good. My girlfriend's making sure my birthday's good. Okay, my parents so, are making sure. So, so this plan's in motion. Yeah, for sure. Hell yeah! And congratulations on the new shorty, baby. Mm, thank you. As I said before, I I like the last one, but the new one looks like right for the time, man. Right for now, baby. New energy, new life. <laughs> Feels good to me, man. <laughs> <laughs> Woo. Where did you meet her? Um, really, a guy I used to live with really basically like set us up together, I guess. Two people, but I ain't going to say their names, but the two people basically like hinted towards us, might like each other type shit. And then we ended up actually talking. And uh, it just went on from there. Congratulations, family. Uh, yeah. Was the breakup hard? Uh, no, I broke up with that bitch. Yeah, nah. Yeah, nah. I just ain't. I wasn't feeling the energy. So it is what it is. Mm. I had to separate. And that's how people just, like, people got to understand, like, in real life. You gotta go through shit like that. Like, mm. it's not no fucking fairy tale world. Like, you feel me? Yeah. You gotta really just do what you gotta do that's best for you. Can't live for other people. You gotta live for yourself. And things have been moving very fast. And things Hell are yeah. changing. You know what I mean? It's been a, like a traumatic couple of years now. Right. 
No, hell yeah. Shit has been moving kind of fast slash slow. <laughs> what's, <laughs> what's been the slow bits then? Um, I don't know. Sometimes I go through days where I feel like I've been up for fucking 48 hours. That might be the case. Then. And I've only been up for about 10. Serious? Uh, yeah, I don't know. Days be going slow sometimes, and then sometimes days go really fast mm -hmm. for me. What do you enjoy most about what you're doing at the moment? Um, the music, honestly, just making music and, and, and coming up with these concepts and crazy-ass ideas for the music is really what I like. Yeah, and that, that's showing the music, man. Oh, uh, yeah. When you, how, what is the creative process to come up with your concepts? Um, I mean, I get high and chill with my friends. And I usually, like, watch certain shit or, like, just be so into, we be into shit. Like, if we're focused on, say, we watching fucking Doctor Who. We watching Doctor Who, we about to watch the whole Doctor Who every season. Like, about to pay attention to that shit and then ultimately... I'll take shit from Doctor Who or something that inspired me from Doctor Who and put it in my music and introduce it to my craft type shit, yeah. And just put your own interpretation, like take your own inspiration from that man and twist it into what you need it to be. Mm-hmm. Doctor Who is like several people at the same time. Did you know that? No. You watch Doctor Who? When, uh, How the fuck don't you watch Doctor Who? No reason. <laughs> no reason, fam. That's when I was a kid. Okay, yeah, <laughs> you know yeah, what yeah, I mean? yeah, 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 yeah. Let's not run about that. <laughs> I can take it back to, like, to the dialects and, uh, the, what was it, Cybermen. That's what really stood out about. <laughs> that's, that's, that's what I'm talking about. <laughs> <laughs> that's what really stood out about the show to me. Like, the doctors always, it's, it's a new doctor each mm. season. Yeah, exactly. So, like, it, you'll have a fucking... A 21-year-old doctor guy that's basically the same guy that's going to be in the next season, but they're not the same person. Yeah. And this one might be older. It's like alter reality mm. Doctor Who's mm. type shit. So. And that TARDIS, coming out the TARDIS. Yeah, they always end up sacrificing themselves or something at the end of the fucking show <laughs> like he's Jesus. <laughs> like with the Might as well. He ends up sacrificing himself for everybody he loves. Yeah, powerful, powerful, powerful stuff, man. Mm-hmm. And that's from those, like, for kids programming, but with those, like, adult themes going through, man. That's the power of it, man. Uh, yeah. I was so into that shit. I didn't even think it was some damn kid shit like that. That shit looks crazy. I'd have nightmares watching that shit younger. <laughs> Serious. As a kid, you used to hide behind the chair, man. Man, I'm all fucking... Yeah. This nigga chilling with aliens bigger than him. Mm. Spider-like creatures trying to <laughs> eat him and shit. It got, like, there's episodes where it's, like, haunted and demons and shit. Mm. It's crazy. What other things do you like for inspiration, man? Um, Dragon Ball Z? Anime, yeah. Yeah, anime. Watch a lot of anime. That's some, uh, some fire shit to watch. It opens your mind. It, it definitely is creative as mm. fuck. Shows you a different world that you ain't never seen. And just comes from somebody's head. Just watching it and, and, and knowing, like, damn, this came out of somebody's fucking head. <laughs> like, this nigga thought of this shit and he brought it to reality. Mm. And what's amazing about those people, they weren't high when they did that either. Mm. They weren't getting high when they thought that crazy stuff. Know? Oh, I would think not, wouldn't you? Maybe How would they you were. Know? How would I know? I always thought it was some, like, real straight sort of Japanese writers. I mean, <laughs> I've done a lot of shit without being high, <laughs> I just, I like to be high. It really opens my mind even more. It lets me focus on, because I'm ADHD, so, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'd be like, Ugh. but if I'm just focused on one thing and I mellow myself out to be focused on that one thing, that's what I'm going to focus on. I mean, there's a, 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 a lot of that. Um... And them niggas had to be high making animes. You though. think so? <laughs> Hell yeah. Niggas had to be. They <laughs> off something. Like, even if it's not weed, it might be acid or something. Like, they're off some shit. <laughs> the concepts behind those shows just be too deep. Like, y'all niggas thought way too hard. <laughs> a lot of people suffer from that, man. Especially now. A lot of people. Hell yeah. Like, if you're watching this now, you can see how I probably haven't stopped moving at all. Because I haven't smoked any good weed since I woke up. 
and I'm trying to focus. <laughs> <laughs> well, you're doing great, family. You're doing great. Uh, amazing from the last time to now, man. You seem in a good place right now. Oh, hell you yeah. You seem in a good place, man. Yeah. No, yeah, I'm definitely in a good place. Just been working on the music and trying to get this these albums out the way. Mm. What's the plan with the albums then? Um, I was trying to be more visual mm. with this album, so I'm doing a lot of videos for it. And then uh, this album is really just elevation. Like it's really just me elevating from from this point to mm. this point, you know. That's the growth, man. Now, let's not front, man. Under enemy arms, how crazy is the visuals for that, man? Oh, that's let's not, let's not front about that. That's, that's like epic movie visuals, man. I mean, mad. Mad. We did that shit in one day. For real? Was there some green screen then? Mm -mm. You were just out there in the field? Mm-hmm. Oh my god. The gosh. only part that might have been like it wasn't a green screen, it was a blue screen. Mm. It was the uh the part where I'm riding the bomb. Oh, my favorite part, baby. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> favorite part. Yeah, that's my hot. favorite. From going in the jet to riding the bomb, my favorite part. Yeah, thank you. And you look so happy on that bomb, to be honest. Where was it going? Did, was it actually cuz I thought it was going to target on someone Pacific. I thought I thought somebody's face was going to come up and you was just going to blow them up. Oh uh, no, I blew up the whole entire thing. <laughs> yeah, it was, it was done. A nuke. Yeah, it was powerful. That bomb riding was good, man. The red face, the horns, then the glasses on top of that, just for the extra bit of I looked swag. like an anime character. It looked crazy. Powerful stuff, man. Who were you fighting, though? Just everybody. Um, I was biased. Technically, yeah. I was just in the war, but I wasn't on nobody's team. For real? You just, I just had my, my crew, and we was killing everybody. Yeah, just a random <laughs> player. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> it looked powerful, man. Riding the bomb, and, and then if the, you really pay attention to it, it start off like basically like I'm a dictator type mm, guy mm, in the in the video. Mm. So like basically like my word is law and all this shit. But at the same time, it was like I was a badass going through the war, shooting everybody. Yeah, out there. even my own teammates. <laughs> yeah, might as well. And then you had the rat, <laughs> the, the rat with the mouse. <laughs> he, them yeah, the end. You like that Rainbow just, Dash? Yeah, exactly. Yeah, that motherfucker was hard. Just the, the, the final twist, man. Just the final put it to bed, baby. <sighs> oh, it was crazy, man. And the, the, the uh, special effects elevated, man. Thank you. Uh, uh, when is the album dropping? A uh, couple months. Uh, how far deep are you into it? It's basically finished. I'm just adding. Serious? Yeah. It's been finished for a minute. I'm just adding a lot of shit to mm. it. I got multiple albums I've been working on. So. Yeah, because there's other projects as well. So the one you're working on now, which is finished, but you just got to get out in a couple of months. What are the other ones surrounding that? Uh, I have a full rock project. Whoa. Yeah. Well, uh, was Travis that fun? Barker and Blink. Well, was that fun for you? Yeah, it was fun. Oh, yeah. I did that shit in like a week. Whoa. But I recorded most of the songs in like one day. I'm fire. And uh, is there going to be a rock tour as well then? Uh, I don't know. We have to see. Yeah. That shit might be dope. Uh, I might try to even incorporate both albums into one tour type shit. Perfect. To make it basically. Yeah, it makes sense. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And what's the rock album going to be called? Um, mm -hmm. It got something to do with sharks. Oh, for real? Yeah, it definitely got something to do with sharks. Looking forward to the video. Dude. I love sharks. I feel like I'm a vibrant person, but at the same time, it's like people be like, ah, oh, shit, he's a shark. You know. <laughs> What's your favorite shark then? Mm, that's a good question. Uh, I really like hammerhead sharks. <laughs> Hammerheads are cool, fam. Yeah, they're cool <laughs> as fuck. Their heads, like, they have yeah. better it's, vision than most sharks. Exactly. But. If I was to say, like, my ultimate favorite shark, it would have to be a fucking, a great white, Have course. to be a great white. Yeah, them is like the king best of jungle, ones. man, yeah. Yeah, yeah them is yeah. the king of the jungle. Yeah, man. The megalodon. Mm. <laughs> the ultimate alpha. Yeah, man. 
me. <laughs> Do it, baby. Do it. So that's that. And what's the new album? What's the project that? What, have you got a title? Immortal is the title, yeah? Mm. Or is it? It's... Uh... It has something to do with immortal, and it also has something to do with uh, exclamation. Exactly. Point. So, is it like explanation mark brackets immortal? Exactly. That's what. <laughs> oh you know what I mean? We got there, family. <laughs> we got there. I mean, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? We got there with that one. We just had to see. Yeah, we, we got see. that, man. Everybody's so, what does that mean? Though. Everybody wants to know, like, what is it, it actually called? Yeah, yeah. Oh uh, yeah. No, I'm gonna keep it a secret until it drops. Okay. Uh, how many tracks deep? Uh. You can always expect from me, like, with a real project, like, I'm working on no rock shit, just pure versatility and mm. me being tribute right? I'm going to do, like, 14 songs. 14, is it? 14 uh, mm. to 18. I don't want to do too much, though. Mm. I definitely have a lot of music, but I feel like my fans should just get... And it, are you going to do videos for every track? Uh, no, I don't want to oversaturate my videos, yeah, but yeah. I also... I do want to get my point across with the video, so mm. if I can just do, like, maybe, if I got 14 songs, doing, like, six videos is cool. Mm. You know, just to have them, I guess. Just to put them in a part of the legacy. And for people to understand the song better as well. Right. Because mm. I'm also the type of person, I'll drop a project and there will be a video, there won't be a video to no songs on that project. <laughs> Which is crazy to me. We're really excited by it, man. Don't let this, don't get me, you know, get me wrong. We are really excited by it because I think under enemy arms is just you set a whole new level there, man. I appreciate that shit. <laughs> are you concerned about legacy? Yeah, I'm definitely. Seriously, I definitely be into my career. Like I wanna. Does that put you under pressure though? Mm. -mm. It just it makes me focus on longevity and panning my career out and not just being up for anything, I got to definitely approve the things I do. Because it isn't necessarily that I don't want to do things. It's more so like I'll wait to do things when it's the right time to do it. So I think that definitely puts me here more of the times when people think it really keeps me here. But I feel like when I do shit like that, it puts me here. Because the more I do that type of shit, the less oversaturated I am. So when I feel like, oh, my shit going down or something is wrong, you feel me? Bloop, we can do this. And, and at 20, you've got time, man. Hell yeah. I'm young as hell. Yeah, hell of time. Can't wait, man. And obviously, you, you're going to be back for wireless. That's going to be a great moment. Yeah, I'm going to go crazy for that. Crazy. Strictly no smoking on stage. What? Sorry, I didn't say anything. <laughs> what? I didn't say anything. <laughs> yeah, all right. You know, see him be like, Big 14 Arthur. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Enjoy it, man. It's your moment, man. Nah, I don't need to smoke on stage, though. That'll be one mosh pit. Yeah, it'll definitely be a couple mosh pits. Yeah. Uh, what, what, what's your take on mosh pits, man? Because, like, you are naturally built for that. <laughs> um, the mosh pits like if I was to jump in the crowd again like I used to all the time like I definitely know how to keep the mosh pit together that should be fun like, to open up the mosh pit and shit basically I am like people see me on camera I do look kind of small on camera but when I'm in person I'm big as hell kind of so yeah. You know, being in the crowd and being able to start the mosh pit and shit, like, I just got to push everybody out the fucking way and yell at them. <laughs> and then once well, I do that... Well, take the cordless, fam. You'll be good. Take the cordless. Right. <laughs> take the cordless. Get and the fuck <laughs> back! Open the pit! Yo, wall of death, man. Oh, my days. Well, I hope you have a great birthday. I think that that's going to be a lot of fun, man. I'm going to try. Thank you. Yeah, man. More face tats, man. Face tats are looking good, man. Thank you. Yeah. I think, see, with the face tat, I think face tats can really work if you do them right. Um, yeah, because I look at it like my face tats is really, like, meaningful, but at the same time, they're, like, promotional, like, they're, mm. they're business moves. Mm. They're not necessarily non-smart gestures. Like, I know I'm good in music. I know this is what I want to do. I know I want to be in music for a long time. So I'm going to do whatever to keep myself doing that shit. So 
it's like these are smart decisions to me. You know what I'm saying? Because yeah. it's my legacy. Yeah. It's what people know me for. The first thing you see is this. So. Mm. Mm. My first tattoo ever was the 14 in the middle of my head. Mm. So, yeah. And then my second one was love scars under my eye mm. before the song came mm. about. So. Yeah. And it got a lot of numbers going on as well, man. Mm-hmm. 1400. Yeah, numbers are significant, man. Yeah. I mean, I like your tattoos. I mean, someone like Post Malone has just got the... Like, it's, it's a different type of tat on your face, man, isn't it? Um, Post Malone's more on some rock star shit. Yeah. Like, uh... Like, uh... Who else is on some rock star shit but ain't really tat their face? Like, MGK. Mm. MGK doesn't... He ain't really tat his face all like that, mm. but he has mm. tats everywhere. He ain't even tat his hands either. I told him not to, because he's a good fucking movie star. Mm. He needs to keep his hands blank. Mm. <laughs> and he's good in the movies, man. For sure, he's yeah, definitely he's, good. He's Did true. you, uh, what was that fucking movie on Netflix? Oh, yeah. Huh? The Dirt. Dirt, The Dirt, The Dirt. You watch that shit? Yeah, yeah. That shit's amazing. He played the good. He nah, he played, nah, he did it every time. Impressed, man. Would you want to do, would you want to do movies? Yeah. yeah. I want to create them, though. That's actually what something I'm I'm interested in, like sitting down and coming up with something like that, like a movie or shows, animes, shit like that, video games. So that like the whole process, man. Um, I mean, really, just getting high, coming up with the ideas. Yeah, <laughs> and like they're winning, man. And like they're winning, man. That's what it is, man. That's what it is. Now. No grill, but you're sparkling. Hold that thought. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my days. Hold that thought. Oh my days. Oh my there needs to be theme music playing right now. Oh, oh my, my god. god. Oh my god. Yeah. Fuck. <laughs> you know, it really takes artists like 10 years of their whole career to get this much jewelry. And this isn't even all my jewelry. If you've got an old one, you don't want any more. <laughs> <laughs> Trippy red gift chain to Tim Westwood. Oh, thank you, man. Shiny, <laughs> baby. That's better. That better get some, get me all the spins. <laughs> For have all the fucking. I better be your favorite person on the playlist. They gonna be like, why is the playlist full of trippy red? <laughs> because I gave him a chain, bitch. <laughs> Oh, someone didn't find my grill earlier. And there's still loose change in there, baby. There's still loose change in there. It's far from done. I don't even have my eight bar chain. I don't got three different grills. Uh, what else? I don't have my watches, my rings, but I do have my chains. Oh, my choker's broke. Niggas trying to walk away. <laughs> but, <laughs> I should have broke his out. That's the truth we know and love. <laughs> out there shining, man. Catch, bitch. 
See, I would have had a slightly bigger person looking after my children. No offense to you, my brother. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> Seriously. I'd have someone no with slightly more hedge. No one's going to touch him. But maybe he's the undercover dude the that you wouldn't tap. Right <laughs> yeah, but. Yeah, the, the bigger person is on the other side of the door. The door. He's fine. Okay, yeah, but he he's got a lot of responsibilities. And I would have had a. You think people want to fuck with me? You want to fuck with me? You want to fuck with me, mate? <laughs> Hello, governor. You want to fuck with me, mate? <laughs> Bloody hell. I mean, and that stuff is so well made as well, man, because I, I want to see that break a TV screen, man. You already seen me break a TV yeah. screen. Yeah, no, I can't do that with these ones. <laughs> you are stacking nicely, brother. Thanks. This is an amazing piece. This is an amazing piece. You like that shit? Yeah, I like that a lot, man. Appreciate it. Look. Yeah, it feels real good out there, man. Feels real good. <laughs> shining, baby. Oh, shining. Shining. Oh, yeah. So, exciting times, man. After your birthday, what's the plan, man? Chill? Yeah, I'm going to be right back to work. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. Right back to work. Now, was X just your last birthday then, man? The passing of X and mm -hmm. all the court cases was your 19th? The 18th, yeah. Um, so you've had some messed up birthdays, man. Yeah, yeah. Like, I used to spend my birthdays just walking around by myself and shit. Really, nobody with me. And sh That's how all my birthdays really went, though. A couple of them was okay, but I always hated my birthday my whole life. <laughs> You're like, sad. yeah. It's weird, that, man. Hell yeah. Yeah. I ain't got a phone. I've been through that, man. You're going to have some sad-ass birthdays, man. Not this time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, I'm real pleased about your new girl, man. She's, she sounds definitely a blessing, man. Hell yeah, for sure. Amazing. Immaculate. <laughs> sounds, sounds like the one man. Yeah, sounds like the one man. I mean, it's all real life, so see, see what happens, man. Um, what would you say, like, uh, like I mean, your, your swag level's off the fucking meter. That's not fun. Your swag levels are crazy. Thanks. Um... The way you dress, the whole vibe is just like. <laughs> Swag. <Yeah. laughs> nah, I um, I actually wasn't even really dressing all like that. Just a minute ago, I was chilling, but now I just feel like it's time for me to get back mm. to the dress and shit. Is that right? Yeah. Any t anytime I put anything on though, it always like sets the bar, you know. Okay, uh, you got favorite designers? Uh, I mean, I'm fucking with Palm Angel right now. Oh, serious? I love Palm Angel. Yeah, nice tees, man. Yeah, they make some dope shit. Mm. I like their sweatsuits mainly. Oh, yeah, and they've got some bright colors, man. Uh-huh. Damn, what the fuck did I spill on my pants? Uh, What else do I like? I like Gucci, too. A lot of people be hating on Gucci, but I like Gucci. That shit's so fire. Mm. Uh, fucking uh, Ivizu. Oh, real? Yeah. Yeah, they yeah. reached out. They're giving me some shit. Oh, that's love. I fuck with Ivizu. Mm. So, and free shit is the best. Yeah, I mean, I mean it, it just depends. Like, I've gone through three, four years getting free shit, mm. free clothes, and I gave away all those clothes to my little <laughs> homies for free because them shits was not fire. But if these are pants, I won't be giving them to nobody unless it's mm. somebody that's really going to take care of the pair of pants I give them. Yeah. <laughs> and what's nice about that, it's nice to break off people with, you know, the free shit that you don't want. Right. Hell yeah, yeah. it's no, hell no, nice. For sure. so yeah. I don't need it. Yeah. I mean, how life has changed, man, from SoundCloud to now. <laughs> <laughs> right. It's changed drastically. From that early hustle to now, man, is mad. Yeah, yeah it's massive. A massive change. What? In my world. 
<laughs> what, 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 have you found, what have you found the best and the worst of that change then, man? Um, the best part is just now how my life yeah. has been set up, you know. But the worst part is maybe not being able to drop when I feel like it. But technically, I, technically I can drop when I feel like it, but it's like... You know, those moments I be feeling like, damn, I want to drop right now. Right now. But it's like, you can't. Yeah. You got to at least wait a day or two. So when you really with SoundCloud, drop, you just, like, you just Yeah, just with SoundCloud, that. I was just it's like, just popping fuck it, baby. that, this is a hit. Yeah, yeah. Threw it just out popping there. popping it. Yeah. Got that motherfucker out there. Yeah. But maybe, such is the nature of the game, man. Yeah. But Small price. It's off for the best. It yeah. works better that way anyway. Yeah. Yeah, yeah man. Well, looking forward to hanging out for, with you at Wireless. Um, You're going to be there, right? Yeah, man, we're going to be there. I bet. Yeah, you got to come chill with me. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. And maybe come through one of the parties we do. It'd be nice to see you up in there, man. Okay. Oh, yeah. It'd be fun, right. man. I'll pull up. Yeah, I'd love you to pull up, man. Okay. Yeah, man. And uh, thank you very much for the last freestyle. Hell freestyle yeah. was epic. This one was dope. Yeah. We should maybe build towards the next. Just overreaching, but... Let's do it towards uh, one wireless. Can we get a co-sign from you guys? Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Well, let's do it, man. Hell Looking yeah. forward to it, man. And thanks for getting out of your bed, man. Appreciate the gear. Yeah, I'm finna go right back. <laughs> right now. <laughs> Family, thank you for coming to Always Love, thank man. You. Always Hell love. Yeah. Too much for TV. Favorite.